World Tourism Day this morning. We're highlighting some of the impacts that visitors have in our local economy. News 4's Hope Winter is learning about all Explore and More has to offer. Hope. Yeah, good morning, Allie and Chris. All morning long, we've been talking to local organizations on how they've seen an economic boost from tourism over the past few years. And we're here with Michelle from Explore More, learning about what they've been seeing right in the heart of the city. Michelle, can you tell us a little bit about how tourism impacts your business? It has been wonderful. We're starting to see that surge. So we had the 2019 where we opened and, and it was busy. And then we have the 2020 years, the years we don't want to really talk about, which is the COVID. And now we're seeing families and tourism coming back. So not only people from the city of Buffalo coming to the museum, residents of Erie County, surrounding counties, but we're seeing our Canadian visitors come back, visitors from all over, which is great. We collect zip codes, so it's so awesome to see that they're coming from Texas, California. Um, but I think just that being right on Canal side and having that whole boom of just cultures and all these things that everyone's doing, it's just been lovely to see tourism come back. Yeah, and you guys are right in the middle of Buffalo. Um, what are, you know, how do you, how does it feel to have the whole community around you? It has been awesome. So we've had a lot of construction. Uh, I hear that all the time, but construction is good. It means that we are booming. We're, we're back, you know, and it's so nice to see the visitor center you know, going behind us, Heritage Point next to us. Um, and just over the next couple of years, how um, the development will change the landscape of what downtown really looks like in a positive way. Um, and we want that and we're right in the center of it. And it's a lot of fun. And speaking of developing, you are, you guys are developing as well. Can you tell us a little bit about what's in the near future for Explore More. I sure can. So we are closed until October 18th um, and we are doing multiple phases of construction. So when you come back on the 18th, it won't be completely done. Um, I think we were talking about, you know, how long will it take? And we have construction really slated all the way through 2025 in terms of bringing new exhibits in. Um, but for this particular phase, we are adding or extending our third floor. We're just too small, which is a good problem to have. Um, and then we're adding our modern disposal recycling exhibit, which is a good to be a lot of fun for the kids. Um, just refreshing the exhibits, knocking down some walls. So you're going to see a lot of changes from that when you come back in October to what's happening in December to what's happening in spring, um, adding some soft play under three toddler areas, which will be a lot of fun, changing over the houses, changing over moving water in 2024. Um, but it's just been a good experience. Thank you, Michelle, so much for meeting with us this morning. And if you would like to learn more about Exploring More, we'll have more information on our website, wivb.com. But for now, Live in Buffalo, Hope Winter News 4. Certainly interested to check that out when it reopens. Thanks, yeah, so. looking forward to that a few weeks.